Kriti Kumari Cha, Department of English, Krikasulu Nisu, Department of Political Science, Sadarshanu Khira, Department of Sociology. Undergraduate topics for the year 2022. Nisanu KCCA, Department of Education, Kroku Prade, Department of English, Lonehunu Lidia Ornu, Department of History, Vihuri Chisho, Department of Political Science, Vilasunu Sophi, Department of BBA, Chongli UK, Department of Chemistry, Rokasini Niyo Chale, Department of Physics, Kekrisano Kusu, Department of Zoology, Ms. Kitatoli Yaptomi, Department of Mathematics, Ms. Rina Rai, Department of BBA, Mr. Hosea Kent, Department of BBA, Tamchen Menla Wali, Department of Economics, Mr. K. Benjamin, Department of Sociology. To be present in the midst of esteemed clergy members, scholars, brilliant minds, and intellectuals on this noble occasion. It's indeed a privilege to be a part of this important annual event of St. Joseph's College Autonomous Chapman. In the beginning, let me extend my heartiest congratulations to all the graduates on completing their degrees from this distinguished institution. I would like to congratulate the faculty members, administrative team, and the parents of the graduating students on this occasion. Today, it fills my heart with pride to see a batch of promising youngsters armed with the knowledge and skills are ready to accomplish their dreams. It has come to my knowledge that uh, Joseph's College holds the distinction of being the largest college in Nagaland ever since its inception in the year 1985. It's remarkable to know that the institution has uh, emerged as one of the top uh, autonomous colleges in the Northeast. As such, there is no doubt that the students of uh, St. Joseph are conversant with extraordinary knowledge under the guidance of their competent faculty. It is praiseworthy how the college that started with 85 students has amassed an enrollment of uh, over 4,000 students uh, at this moment. I am pleased to know that St. Joseph College has been accredited with the grade A by NEC in the year 2016. The college seems to have left no stone unturned in providing quality higher education to the youth of Nagaland as well as the neighboring states. Further, I must say that the state of the art and the student friendly infrastructure of the college is really impressive. The students of the college must feel themselves very fortunate to be learning in such an environment away from the cell of urban life. My dear graduates, seeing you all today evokes a sense of nostalgia and optimism as I call my dear decades ago. As someone who has lived through your experience, I can say that today's occasion marks a memorable event in your life as your hard work and perseverance comes to completion. I congratulate the students and students graduating from this college for your excellent academic performance and thank the faculty members for shaping the young minds. Dear graduates, today the college has commissioned you
to be an ambassador of change, to be an ambassador of peace, and to be an enlightened global citizen. As we move on, I want all of us to build these five capacities. The first capacity is research and inquiry. The 21st century is about the management of all the knowledge and information we have acquired in the college and university. And the very addition we bring to it. Today, we have the ability through technology to truly teach ourselves to become the lifelong learners. Do not stop from here, but pursue higher education, pursue research works, and cultivate the spirit of inquiry. Always ask yourself these five techniques. Who, what, where, when, and why. That is the first capacity we must cultivate research and inquiry. The second capacity that we should learn is creativity and innovation. The management of knowledge in the 21st century is beyond the capacity of single individual. Therefore, you must move out of the realm of the individual and shift your care into the realm of network groups. Learn how to manage the knowledge collectively and more creatively. When the information is networked, the power and the utility of the information grows because Creativity leads to thinking. Thinking leads to innovation. Innovation leads to knowledge. And knowledge is power. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter. And Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter.